Hi, I'm Paul Barry. Welcome to Media Bites. And boy, did Channel 10 get a bargain. Nine's loss is our game here at Network 10. Yeah, Incredible lovely. woman, smart, funny, down to earth. Yes, $1.8 million a year wasn't enough to keep Lisa Wilkinson at nine. Even though it could buy six Lee sales, nine of me, and hundreds of my staff. But Lisa is special. Yes, we loved her supplement ads as well. Are there natural options out there to help support your healthy blood pressure? The answer is yes. And back at today, her colleagues were reeling at her departure. It was a surprise to us all. It's sad to say we're all a little bit shocked and it will take a little while to sink in. So how was Lisa doing? The $2 million question. With cameras trained on her Sydney home, hubby Peter Fitzsimons told the paps. She's having a lovely sleep in after an extraordinary day. So thank you. Um, best, sleep in, best sleep in 10 years. Asleep? At 10am? Oh, hold on. Breaking news. Awake! Ha <laughs> ha! And OK, thank God. In fact, I'm more than OK. I'm great. But Nine's boss was soon hitting back at the runaway star, telling the telly, Lisa ain't Carl. Ouch! And claiming it wasn't about equal pay because she was after more than Carl. And spreading herself too thin with work at rival media companies. Ooh, it's a bitchy business. And the media can't get enough of it. More than 600 items on radio and TV and 4,600 in all. I mean, really. But now for some trivia. A nuclear war may break out at any moment. And last weekend, it happened. This is BBC television from London. Normal programming has been suspended. Oh my God. North Korea launches unprovoked nuclear attack on United States. Terror in plain sight. A plutonium missile. World War Three closer than ever. Quiet, where's the bunker? What, what, what do you mean? Vi video clip on rage? Bloody idiots. No wonder punters were alarmed. Panic the shit out of me, one viewer tweeted. And another one asked, what if you woke at 1am to view this on TV? <gasps> You'd hope it was a nightmare. But now to the US, where NFL presenter Dick Stockton kinda missed the point. Kurt, Terry, Howie, Michael, and Tony look on graphic for the final two bullet points. Whoops, <laughs> not meant to read that one. And remember this famous fail? Good morning, you're watching ABC News 24. I'm Michael Rowland. No, you're Virginia Trioli. And there was also this. This is BBC World News. I'm Jonathan Charles, kept hidden for almost two decades and forced to bear children. Bizarre. But now let's go outside to where the wild things are. I'm Scott Mattis, live in Hernando, Mississippi, where there's been spottings of a cougar, and that's not it. That looks like a house cat. Ha! <laughs> and that's the last cat video you'll see on Media Bites this year. But we'll be back with Media Watch on Monday night on the ABC after Four Corners. Don't miss it. Bloody idiots! <sighs>